First video of 2019. New year, new me. Just kidding guys, I'm not even gonna go there. Or am I? The year just started and I used to be just like you guys whenever your peers came around to talk about their stupid resolution bullshit. And weirdly enough, stuff like that would always go kinda like, so, what are your new year's resolutions? Uh, I don't really think I have any. How about you? Well, I'm happy you asked, cause, I'm gonna start eating healthier today. I'm gonna have a six pack in February. I'm gonna marry a princess in March, get my own castle in April, divorce in May, buy a pony in June, raise money for charity in July, and also I'll oh, probably- Hold up, hold up, wait, um, what? Mm. Did you just say eat healthier? Didn't you just order pizza? As much as that kind of sounds shitty, I can kind of see where people are coming from when they're trying to start new goals for the new year. It all kind of feels like a reset button kind of idea. I feel like it's more so a psychological thing. I mean, of course we can all start with being a better person, uh, bettering yourself, setting goals in the, in the middle of the year. But it kind of is true and we cannot disregard that. It is a motivating thing to know that we're starting a new year, you can set new goals and kind of go from there. Um, you know, new gear, new uh, opportunities and chances, new me! I'm gonna, I'm gonna drop that one. Anyways, I do think it's fine to set goals for the new year and to come up with new things to do when a new year is starting. However, I do think that it's very important that when you do set those goals, you're actually very dedicated and actually stick to those. Even though I know that 80% of us is probably not gonna be doing that. And now that we're on topic, why not throw in a couple? First, I wanna start off saying that I do wanna keep my personal resolutions to myself, and I do not wanna share them with the public. Especially because I think that my personal resolutions revolve around me and my personal goals to better myself as a human. So I don't think that other people should be knowing that, or I mean, I guess it's more important for me to know that. But I do have some stuff that I wanna share with you guys, so don't worry, I have some stuff coming up. I am gonna be doing some stuff on this channel a little bit differently, just a little bit. It's not gonna be one of those things where the entire content on my channel changes and that you're not gonna be able to recognize my channel. It's not gonna be something like that. But I do wanna work on more things with more structure and aim for more things so that I ultimately uh, end up uploading more and upload better content or like better quality content because that's kind of what I want to aim for. So how am I gonna do that? What does that mean? Well, I'm gonna do themed months for production. As many of you know, I do skits, vlogs, animation, music, and all that kind of stuff, but it's pretty much all over the place. There's just not enough structure, and I feel like I work on so many things that I lose track of a lot of them, and that's kind of sad, since for the past seven years, I feel like there's still a lot of projects that never actually made it to the light. Yes, that's how long I've been making videos. Personally, I feel like for someone that's been making content for this long, I haven't really accomplished enough. I feel like with the type of stuff I am capable to do, I don't really do myself enough justice or the channel. That's definitely something I want to change. And of course I still really love making videos, but after seven years you kind of start wishing that there were a little more people watching your videos, or that you have a bigger audience, or that you kind of have more people to comment on your stuff and cheer you on. So that is why I'm starting themed months. Well, what exactly does that mean? I am gonna have an upload schedule for the entire year. Month one of the year is going to be random uploads. That means it could be anything. Yeah, it could literally be anything at any time. Um, but I do wanna aim for like three or four videos a month. I am not certain if that's gonna be working but I do really want to work towards that. I'm, I'm willing to put more effort into that stuff. Um, since, you know, a random month is actually probably going to be my easiest month. I can literally do anything at any time. Month two is going to be music month. This means I'm going to be doing anything that revolves around music for the entire month. That could mean I could drop a track or uh, drop a music video maybe. I don't know. I still got to see uh, how, much I, uh, how much time I can put into these things but yeah uh, anything that involves music uh, maybe uh, do some collaborations in terms of music maybe uh, drop an EP or a mixtape or maybe um, make some go out to uh, go outside and make some music 
uh, with, I don't know, sounds from nature. I don't, know, I don't freaking know, but it has to do with music. Um, so, yeah, that's going to be month two. So that means that uh, for this year, that's going to be February. Fe February is where I'm going to be uh, spending all my time on doing anything that revolves around music. So if you're into music or if you are into doing stuff with music, hit me up and we can work on stuff in February. I want to make some cool stuff that you guys like. Month three is going to be movie month. Now movie month is going to be focusing on skits, it's going to be focusing on short film or stuff revolving around uh, movies or short film or film in general, I don't know. Uh, so yeah, a lot of stuff I can do with that. Uh, I don't have a specific schedule for any of these yet. I don't have any specific videos, um, you know, lined up for these months, but I have so many projects that I could easily um, go to my list with projects and kind of start categorizing them so I know in what month I do what project. Oh, also, um, in movie month I could maybe work on movie reviews, so actually do reviews on, on movies I watch or you guys want me to watch, I don't, I don't really know. Um, then we're going to be moving on to number four, which is going to be month four, which is going to be animation month. Animation month, you already, you can already tell, it's probably going to be me um, uploading animations all of the month, uh, which consists of skits, animation skits. Uh, that I voice act with friends um, or myself um, or um, animated music videos or animation tests maybe I'm gonna try some crazy stuff and I wanna just upload it uh, well that month uh, is going to be the month for it and it's going to be appropriate because you already know that is gonna be animation month uh, month 5 is going to be vlog month vlog month that basically means I'm going to be making videos like this where I talk to the camera more um, it can be about any topic really um, okay my laptop died <laughs> vlog month it's gonna be me making videos where I talk to the camera like this um, talk about specific topics uh, it could be any could be anything could be a rant could be advice could be I don't know a lot of things it's a lot easier to connect to me as a person if you see me talk to the camera as much as I uh, would like to. So, yeah. Uh, I might actually change my channel banner to kind of fit the description or fit the idea I'm talking about right now. So it becomes a lot more easy for people to spot when what is going to be coming. Like, I, for example, I sometimes just disappear from YouTube as a consumer and kind of stop watching a lot of YouTubers and then I come back and uh, watch my favorite YouTubers and I binge all their videos. Uh, so if people, if you're like me and you do that too and you kind of disappear from my channel and come back in like a month or two, um, I want you to be able to know where can I find what type of video um, just, you know, instantly. So this month is probably going to be this. This month is probably going to be this. So I want it to be very uh, easy for you to spot. So we'll, we're going to see how that works. Basically, month six is going to be random again it's gonna be one of the random months again the random month i don't know i don't have a name for it yet probably gonna be random month but yeah month six is going to be a random month and i'm gonna be uploading anything anytime and it's just gonna be like that again so this is where everything that previously happened is going to be reset um so month six random month seven is going to be music month eight is going to be movie month nine was going to be animation that means month 10 will be vlog month that means with the remaining two uh, it's going to be month random and month music um, in uh, November and December um, it sounds very complicated right now but it really isn't um, I'm sorry my delivery might be really not good but yeah I know it's a little bit confusing but if this works I think uh, guaranteed um, the upload schedule and my videos overall might be a lot better um, than the previous years. Just hope that... Um... I'm sorry about that one. I thought my camera stopped recording and I was talking to my wall like a crazy person. But anyways, I hope that the overall production on my channel just skyrockets. That's what I want to see for 2019. Uh, people may think that um, just by starting a new year, you don't necessarily become a better person or better at what you're doing. But I think that it starts with your mindset. If your mindset is able to change and you're able to keep dedicated to that, 
yes, things will change because it all starts with a mindset. I am hyped for the new year. I'm hyped that there's so many new chances. New year, new chances, new opportunity, new production, new year, new me. I put a curse on 2019.